Hi, I'm Reverend Dr. Ann DeCor, and I became an ADL minister in 1994. It's been a while. And uh, ADL, I was just saying ADL is one of the greatest gifts that I allowed myself to have. I live in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. I'm a special education teacher and administrator for 36 years, and then I retired, and now I finally said, bite the bullet, and I am now in um, a um, chapel turned into, I know we're not supposed to call ourselves a corporation, but I'm a business. I'm, I'm a 501, but C3. C3, but done through ADL. And I am, this is my third major change in career, but I'm doing my heart work. I'm still teaching at a private school as a substitute, but this is my goal. Um, wow, I took my doctorate with um, ELF and got that in, in 2008, and my thesis became a book, which is Sane and Rational. I just got finished completing a class that came to me all through meditation, so it's Spirit Written, which is the same as my book, and it is a class on the chakras, and it lasted a year and a half, and now I have the whole curriculum, and people that would like to teach the class, I have the curriculum. So I'm not finished yet. I still have a lot to do, and I love the freedom and the ability to be me. I love these yearly retreats. I call it a retreat um, because I get to touch base with A, our founder. We're very fortunate. Barbara Selwa is still here, and it's just a joy to see her. And then all the other wonderful people that I've met through the years, and the fact that humility. I, I'm no better, I'm no different than anybody else and to carry the message of love. And in these times right now, ADL has really helped me get back to all there is is love. And it's been a beautiful weekend up here. And I'm so thrilled to be a part of this organization that's growing by leaps and bounds. And now we need to get young people in and get young people working together. And. Um, they're much more into the electronical electronics that a dinosaur like me has to learn. They just know it. So um, ADL has a is growing. It, it started a new birth in in 2013, and I think it's on the vista of another explosion with the young people. So I feel very humbled to be a part of this organization. And namaste.